Hi, and welcome to the Nut E tutorial getting started. We're going to walk you through just a couple of things to get you into the system, uh, navigate some of the tabs, and update your troop information and add any girls that you need to add. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing you want to do is log in with your username or your login name, which should be your email. And then once you've been added by your service unit product manager, your password will be poptop, P-O-P-T-O-P, -P -P, all lowercase. So we're gonna get signed in. First tab that we land on is the home page. So if you're navigating any of these and you wanna get back to this, just click the home tab button across the top. It'll give you a quick summary of your total sales, how many girls you have participating, and most importantly, has where you can reach your service unit um, product manager down here, and then where you could contact the council. So the membership and our address, our phone, and the best way to reach us is through that membership support, and that'll make sure we get you the, the help that you need. Next tab over is the troops tab. Click that, and we're just gonna make sure we update all of this information to make sure it's up to date and anybody that needs access can get access. We're actually going to delete a couple of these so I can show you how to add somebody. Uh, but once you get in, uh, do check to make sure you have the right level that you're working with selected. If you have mostly brownies or mostly ambassadors or whatever you have most of is what we'd really like you to select unless you are truly a multi-level troop. And that just helps us statistically be able to um, figure out who's selling and at what levels. Next thing we want to do is add a user. So we are going to add Nikki. And her login will be her email, which will be Tuffield at gmail.com. And the password, pop top. And we are going to give her troop administrative access and submit. Uh, and that way she can now get in. As long as she uses her password and username, she can get in and be able to do anything. We don't recommend having more than maybe one or two, one other person in there. Um, but really just know that whoever signs the contract is the one that's on the hook for all of this. The next thing we want to do is add the banking information. Simply put in whatever bank you have. So if it's Wells Fargo, and then put in their routing number, um, whatever that might be, and then your bank account number, and save. Make sure you click whether it's checking your savings. Hopefully everybody has their troop bank account set up to be a checking account. And then we would save it, and then we click the save to save everything on there. Next tab that we're going to look at is the girl orders tab. So once we have all of that information in there, we're just going to add any girls that we don't see already listed. So if they've already been added, they should be in the system. But if for some reason they've been selling and we don't have them in the system yet, we're just going to add them. Um, Veronica C. And her number is... And it's just that simple to add them, and then you'd be able to add their order. We're actually not going to go into the orders quite yet, but hopefully that kind of gives you an overview of the main three things that you need to do. Get logged in, add any or edit any troop data or information that you need to, and then make sure all of your girls are in there. On um, the next tutorial, we'll show you how to actually place that order and submit your order in the Nutty system. Thanks, everybody.